Hey folks, what's up? My name is Noah Chrysler, the RIT Newsman, and this is the IT program at RIT Croatia. IT program is a program that's offered both in RIT's uh, Dubrovnik campus and their Zagreb campus. We're going to talk to students and professors from both programs and teach them more about it. It's going to be cool. We're going to go. I love it. We are here with Preston Meeks. Now, Preston, you're an RIT Rochester student studying abroad. Did you find um, any challenges, you know, finding the correct courses? Or you get a list of the courses they offer, and you get to pick from those what you want to take. You don't need to go on to SIS or anything. It's awesome. That sounds better than planning a normal semester at RIT. We only have class four days a week, so you get three days to go and run around all weekend. Dubrovnik itself is such a lovely city. You have the mountains, you have the ocean right there. It's amazing. So let's talk a little bit about like actual classes. Similar to RIT or there's key differences or what do you think? At its core, they're very similar. A little bit less lecturing and a little bit more class involvement. It's a lot more relaxed. I get to take Wines of the World here. Really? You're in Wines of the World? No, because it got canceled because oh. not enough people signed up. That's the class that fills up first in Rochester because we're starving for culture but here, they just have culture everywhere, so it's fine. Yeah, and they can just go drink. Yeah. <laughs> Tell us a little bit about the program that you're working on. We're working on developing sort of a Pokemon Go-esque tourism game where people can go through and explore the old town of Dubrovnik. You are creating an AR game for tourists to travel around Dubrovnik and get this cool AR experience similar to Pokemon Go. Yes, I am. That is the coolest thing in the world. We got to cut. We don't have any battery. So we are here with Doma Gojtovic. Can you explain to us what the IT major is here? We teach here web and mobile, front-end programming for applications. Does it correlate with um, the programs offered at the main campus? So yes, yes. We are keeping in sync, even like, you know, kind of on a weekly basis, everything stays the same. What is one piece of advice that you give an international student trying to succeed? When you're working in the IT sector, you're working for the entire world. You should know how different people think, what they expect, how they approach things, etc. And that especially applies to people who do IT and, and design programs that anybody in the world can download, I bet. We are here with Stasha Pushkaric, the advisor and mentor for the Robotics Club here. We are working on really applicable projects and now there is the initiative to make the radiological map of the entire country. It's inaccessible by walking because in Croatia we still have a lot of mines, landmines, so more than two million still wow. underground. That's crazy. We don't have that in Rochester. I know. <laughs> the drones, they don't touch the ground and we can fly and measure. So what big benefits do you think Robotics Club give to students, right? It's not organized as a course. I don't teach them anything. I just help them. But, you know, deliverable has to come from them. It's a pretty simple formula. Here is the problem, solve it. Yeah, yeah. And don't come to me with bad news. We are here with? Nico Madesco. Awesome, now Nico, you're an IT student, correct? Yes. So you've actually been to RIT in Rochester. That's a great experience and um, I made a lot of friends there. What was your favorite part of Rochester? Uh, dinosaur barbecue. Yeah. What would be your advice to people who are on the fence about coming here? You should, especially if you want to see King's Landing in real life. Like, don't stay in your bubble and go with locals and talk to them and stuff like that, because that's how you experience the country most. Do you think your study abroad experience changed the way you operate? We here in Croatia are really laid back, like a more extreme version of California people. New York, like it's time is money there. Everything is like fast. That's something I picked up. So I, I kind of have now a medium between that. I'm not too chill, but I'm also not too like work, work, work. What's your favorite part of Dubrovnik? My favorite part? Yeah. Probably like the old town. Yeah. Like it's Assassin's Creed like if you ever played that. Yeah. yeah. That's what I said when we got there and Oscar made fun of me, but it's so cool. Guys, 
Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video about the International Business Program, hit the like button. And hey, if you guys are interested in doing that program and potentially studying here for a couple of months for a whole semester, click the first link in the description. You'll learn everything you need to know. Guys, if you would like to attend RIT, click the next link in the description. You'll learn everything you need to know. Guys, thanks so much for watching. Have a great day. If you could share this on your timeline, I would love you forever. Goodbye. Gonna go learn something. Bye.